What up, Melvin7 here. Marquee matchups are out, uh, obviously the internationals, because club football is unfortunately away until April the 1st. But anyhow, uh, hopefully the foot birthday is tomorrow, the 8th uh, anniversary, and we'll actually get some decent SBCs, but uh, we'll have to wait and see. The first one anyway, Argentina versus Chile. You get a 25k pack for this. This one's probably the most expensive one, although a lot of these players, even though they are high rated, uh, will go for very, very little, but... Um, yeah, the Argentinian players I've got, I've went with uh, two La Liga Argentina, uh, Argentinian centre-backs. There we've got uh, Cabral and uh, Pereja, Pereja, is that how you say it? Anyway, uh, the Chile players we've got is Vargas and uh, we've also got Gutierrez. And I've kind of sectioned it off so we've got League 1 on one side because you can only have a maximum of four players from the same league. Then we've got the four La Liga players and then we've got Bundesliga on the left. Um, there'll be ways where you don't need to get loyalty, like if you could get a, a Hoffenheim player there, that would give um, Vargas pretty much full chem, but anyhow, that's how I did it, 25k pack for that one, we move on, uh, they've been a bit uh, creative with the rewards, this one by far is the worst reward that you get, uh, you need 8 minimum gold players, you get a jumbo gold pack, 25 items, 3 rares, usually pretty shit, Two Republic of Ireland or Welsh players, because you're probably going to be deprived of Republic of Ireland players, it's kind of good that you don't need them, you can just use Welsh players. I've used a Republic of Ireland player and a Welsh player from the Championship. You can use three bronzes, so that's what I've done. And then I've got some Premier League goals at the other side. You need four res, so just make sure you've got that. Very easy, very simple. We move on to the next one. Croatia versus Ukraine. This one, you get a premium Electrum pack, which I believe is uh, a mixture of silvers and gold, six of which are rare, 12 players. Uh, you, you need one Croatia, one Ukraine player, and it looks as though I've accidentally give one of the players uh, in a different SBC. So I hope that I've got someone that keeps the rating. Uh, of course I don't. What about Bernardo Silva, does he work? Nationalities maximum three, fucking terrific. Um, <laughs> I knew this shit would happen. I can use Fakir, yeah, there we go, right. Um, no problem, no, we'll use Fakir, right. Anyway, yeah, maximum of three nationalities, so I've just went with League One. We've got Subasic in net. Um, I can't actually see the player that isn't French here. Like, I'm pretty certain I've only got two nationalities there. But for some reason, whenever I put a different nationality in, it just won't let me. So, uh, yeah. Anyway, we're going to submit that. We get the uh, 500 coins and the premium Electrum pack. Then we've got Mexico versus Costa Rica. And you get a rare consumables pack for this. That could actually be really, really good. Um, you could get some decent position modifiers, you could get a draft token, a uh, free pack, you never know. Anyway, uh, you can use five bronze players, uh, you need four leagues minimum, and uh, of course you need a Mexican and a Costa Rican player, so I've went with La Liga for the Mexican and Costa Rica players, then we've just went with three Spanish centre-backs, and then I've went with a mixture of Football League 2, Football League 1, and also Championship uh, players to get the four leagues, and make sure they're English and basically I get the chemistry. Anyway, submit that and I think you get a 35k pack for completing this overall. So they're mixing it up, which I quite like. Uh, Marky matchups was getting a bit stale and uh, they're giving you some different rewards, uh, changing up the requirements as well, um, trying to do something different, which I like. Right, the jumbo pack is probably going to be the worst one. Uh, last time I've opened a rare consumables pack, I think they might have done that once before in Marky matchups, but. Um, that actually gave me the most valuable thing in the uh, the entire thing. I think I got a draft token or something like that. I'm not sure he's really worth anything. I'm just going to discard that. Um, the Korean player might have went for something. I don't know. But, uh, right. Rare consumables pack. We'll open this, of course. I mean, I don't expect to get anything. Doesn't look as though this has been... Actually, actually, I think that's actually been really, really good. Um... That goes for a couple of K. I mean, I might as well check, but I'd probably say that's 10 to 15 K with the consumables in that one. Right, um, I'm going to open this uh, Electrum Players Pack first, see what we can get in that. No special card, unfortunately. Um, doesn't look as though we've got a lot. We've got a few silver players that I don't currently have, which is useful, especially for upcoming league SBCs. Next one we've got is a 25 K pack, see what we can get in that. Um, yeah, I, I, as you've probably noticed, I've stopped playing Foot Champs um, recently. I might start playing it again soon. I just got really, really bored with it, if I'm honest. Um, you know, 40 games over a weekend, just I just didn't have the time. 
Anyway, 35k pack, not a walkout. It's a decent sized flare, 84, 85. It's as Pillicator 84. I think there was a couple of 83s in there as well. The flares, yeah, there was one. Um, William Carvalho, also Morata. So, I mean, not great, but I've had a lot worse from marquee matchups. Is there any promo packs? There is, and they expire tomorrow, which is pretty interesting because the last lot of promo packs they did expire two or three days. Um, so yeah, that would tie in with the theory that the foot birthday starts tomorrow, so hopefully it does, but hopefully you have enjoyed, subscribe if you haven't already, like the video, and yeah, peace.